Hi everyone and welcome to this video. I'm Sneka from measureschool.com and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can add a contact to a specific point of an automation in Active Campaign. And this can be really helpful if you want to add a contact to your automation but you don't want them to have to go through each single step in order to get to a desired spot. And to do that, we will use Active Campaign's goal automation action and we will use a tag as a condition for this goal. But you can use other conditions, for example, a um, yeah, visiting a specific page or opening a campaign and a lot more. But we will use a tag in our example. So to get started, head over to the automation where you want to add your contact to. And let's imagine we want to add our contact to right in front of the second email so that they will receive the second email. So then we have to click on the little plus icon right um, before that and click on conditions and workflow and then select goal. And right here we have to type in the name of the goal. You can basically choose any name or we just call it jump to goal and then um, choose a condition for this goal. As I already said we use a tag so let's type in tag axis and we call it jump to goal and then save it. Now we have contact has tag jump to goal as a condition and here we just have to leave it as below context position and if the contact does not meet goal conditions continue anyways and then click on save. So now our goal is set up the right way now we have to add our contact to this specific point. So let's head over to our contacts page in Active Campaign and search for our contact. You can do that by name or email address and then click on the contact and now add the tag which just created and the automation manually. So let's click on tag and type in jump to go and then also add our contact to the automation and in our case it's test. Okay, and that's basically it. Now our contact should be successfully added to this automation. Um, we can actually see the path of the contact if we click on the automation and then click on view. And now we can see the automation path right here and you can see that the contact added to this automation manually and it jumped right to the goal and must have gotten the second email. So that was it, a really quick tutorial on how to add a contact to a specific point of an automation in active campaign. I hope it was helpful to someone of you. Thank you for watching and happy measuring. Hey there, did you like this video? Then hit that like button down below. And if you want to find out more about the data-driven way of digital marketing, then maybe also subscribe to our channel right over there, where we bring you new videos every week, tutorials, marketing tech reviews, and tips and tricks on better tracking in general. Now, my name is Julian. See you in the next one.